Cartesian coordinates to polar coordinates. Let's go over how to convert between the two. Here are the two conversion equations we'll use. Then suppose we have the point negative 1 comma negative 1 in Cartesian coordinates, meaning x is equal to negative 1 and y is equal to negative 1. Then we can plug these values into our equations to solve for r and theta. And since our Cartesian coordinate negative 1, negative 1 is in the third quadrant, our value of theta needs to reflect that, which is why we choose 5 pi over 4. And hence, our coordinate in polar coordinates is as follows. And that's how we convert from 